Let us begin. Isaac, laureate of the Da Vinci Institute, a PhD granting university in South Africa. Here is our circle, and here is its diameter, AB. What is the difference between circle and triangle? Hey, isn't this an AMC problem? Are, are you in the wrong classroom? Man, K-12 schools get mixed up all the time. Anyways, so we have A, B, and this length is 2. So, okay, it is extended to a point D outside the circle, so the BD is 3. So this is point D, and this is 3. Okay. Point E is chosen so that ED is 5. So, this is 5. Is it true that 5 is the evil number? No, that's 6. 5. 6. 5. 6. 5. 6. 5. Six. five. What the fuck? Okay. 6. 5. My mom told me it's 5. <laughs> Are you too mentally? <laughs> Never mind. Go to the kindergarten classroom, it's right down the hall. Anyways, since this triangle is inscribed in a circle, it must be right. Any triangle whose hypotenuse uh, is the same as the diagonal in a uh, The diameter of a circle is a right triangle. Okay, so, begin. How are we going to do this? Well, we also know this is right because line ED is perpendicular to line AD. So, first of all, we're going to have to find AE. And we're going to use the Pythagorean theorem for that. So 2 plus 2 plus 3 equals? 5. 2. We're just going to move on from two. that. So, uh... <coughs> A squared plus B squared. The square root of A squared plus B squared, which gives us A is going to be 7, B is going to be 5. I swear if you say, but I was right. But I, I was right. shoot. <laughs> you aren't even the one I was talking to. You idiot. You dumb on the... Oh. Oh, sorry, sorry. Um, C is going to be equal to the square root of 74, thus. My mom said log. Take Shut it, up! Take it easy. Okay. So now, think about this for a second. What is the sign of B, A, C? So, B, the sign of BAC, believe it or not, is actually equal to the sign of DAC, which is also equal to the sign uh, of... Lowercase D, lowercase A, lowercase C. Shut the... F mm -mm, sorry. <laughs> um, okay. So, that's that. Anyways... Now, how do we find these? Well, what are these two? Well, what is sign DAC? Uh, excuse me, Professor, can you move this guy? He's a low IQ. So, mm -hmm. the, the sign of DAC would be opposite over hypotenuse. The hypotenuse is 7 in this case, but the opposite, AC, is something we want to know. It's equal to sign of BAE. And this is 4, while this is the square root of 74. So, we have uh, 28 equals AC times root 74. So, AC is equal to 28 over the square root 
of 74. Wow. Okay, so now that we've done that, all we need to do is do the Pythagorean theorem. So, 28 over 74, the square root of this squared plus x squared is going to be equal to 4. Okay, so now we have 28 squared, which is beep, boop, 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 beep, boop. To 400. I swear, if yeah, you speak... because it cancels out with the square root. What He's the? a low IQ person, Professor. Both of you are low IQ people. What are you, babies? Are you 18? No. <laughs> Anyways. <coughs> Uh, let's just do some very simple baby math that I hope you all understand. So, that is 784. Plus x squared is 4. So, now we simply solve for x. So, just give me a second. 16 and 16 times 74 is going to be equal to 100. What the hell is wrong with you? Are you? Anyways, <coughs> uh, 4 times 6 is going to be equal to uh, 24. Uh, that's going to be 6. Yes, I know, this is unnecessary, I can use a calculator, blah, blah, blah. This is the AMC, there is no using calculators to speak of. So, 7 times 1 is uh, 7, plus 4 is 11, so 481184. Okay, so 1184 minus 784, that should be fairly easy to solve, or 74. So x squared is equal to 400 over 74, thus x is 20 over the square root of 74. But that is this length. So now we're going to find that area. And can anyone here tell me how to do that? Area is the square root of... Shut the hell up! What about you? Then times it. Anyways, uh, uh, excuse me, professor. My mom said area doesn't matter. Get out of the classroom! Who, oh, who the hell is giving you ways to talk with your mom? Are people smuggling earbuds in here? Anyways, one over two times twenty over the square root of seventy-four times twenty-eight over the square root of seventy-four. Which is go going to make this, well, we have 20 times 28, 560 over 2, so 280 times uh, over 74. So, that's 140 over 37, which makes the answer D. Thank you everybody for watching.